Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a dollar store makeup look. So I got all of the products in this video from the dollar store. They each cost a dollar, obviously. And I'm so excited to do this. I know this is kind of a popular YouTube tag, but I'm really excited. I don't have any dollar brushes though, so I'm just gonna be using drugstore brushes for the most part. Okay, yay. Let's get started. Okay, so we are going to start off by using the Sassy and Chic BB Beauty Cream and the shade Light. So I'm just going to squeeze a little onto the back of my hand and I'm going to use the Real, Techni Real Techniques Expert Face Brush from their holiday collection. Wow, this has a chemically smell. It also has surprisingly good coverage for... It's not what I expected. And next up we... I don't have any concealer. I couldn't find any concealer at the drugstore. So I'm going to go ahead and just start setting my face, I guess. I have the LA Colors Contour Palette in medium. It's very thin. How do you open it? Oh, I don't want to break it. Okay, there we go. So we are going to start by using the Wet n Wild Powder Brush. And I'm just going to dip it into the light color. And I'm going to use the same brush and I'm going to dip into this shade, the dark shade, the contour shade. I'm not sure if I'm getting any product. Okay, moving on, I am going to use the next product, which is the LA Colors Single Blush in Berry Plum. And it comes with this little brush, but those aren't great. So I'm just going to keep using the same big powder brush. And I'm going to dip my brush into there. Ooh. So next up I'm going to be doing my brows and I'm going to use the LA Colors Brow Tint in dark brown. So the drugstore or the dollar store obviously didn't have a great selection for brow products unfortunately. They had a lot of products for like, they had a really big beauty section. They just didn't have a great selection for some of their products. Um. This is only a brow tint. Normally I use a brow pencil, but the only brow pencils they had were in like black. So I'm just gonna go ahead and use this. Okay, so now I'm looking back at the foundation. And it really doesn't have that great of coverage. Like you can see all these little pimples on my face. So it had okay coverage. It just wasn't great. But again, it was a it was only a dollar. And 
It was only a BB cream, so you can't expect amazing things. So I'm actually not hating how the brow tint worked out. Really, um, it, it's fine. It's fine for what it is. So next up I'm going to go into the... LA Colors Eyeshadow Nude Palette. There are 12 shades in this palette, you guys. There's a little plastic thing. There's this little sponge applicator thing that we are going to ignore. But this is the palette. So it's got some it's got some pretty good colors in it. So I'm going to start off by using a Wet n Wild brush. And I'm going to dip into this corner shade. It's kind of a light brown right there. So far so good. Okay, next up I'm going to use this second shade in on the second row. You want to tap this off, you guys. A lot of fallout. And into the crease. And I'm going to use the same brush. As you can tell. Okay. Next, I'm going to take another Wet n Wild brush. Another fluffy Wet n Wild brush. And I'm going to take the last shade or the first shade in the last, I don't, this dark brown shade in this palette. And it is right there. And I'm going to use this brush. On the very outer corner. Okay. So I'm actually going to go and grab the sponge applicator. We are actually going to use it, you guys. And we're going to use the first shade in this palette which is like a light gold color and apply it to the lid there we go <laughs> okay so that is all I'm doing for the eyeshadow I'm going to take this LA colors auto eyeliner in black and I'm going to just line my eye line, line my eyes And next up, I'm going to take, I have, oh, here it is. Next up, I'm going to take the Wet n Wild Mega Wear Mascara in black. Now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to do the other eye and I will be back in just a second. Okay guys, I'm going to finish off this look by applying the Wet n Wild Mega Last Lipstick in Dark Wine. I'm actually kind of happy with um, how the look turned out. I think that it was kind of like a kind of a wintry look with the dark red lipstick, the berry blush, you know, just kind of a wintry colors. Anyways, I'm, I gotta say, I'm kind of impressed with most of the products. I'm not too disappointed by anything. I'm not in love with the, um, the mascara wasn't the best, and the BB cream was not my favorite BB cream that I've ever used. But I really didn't hate anything. And most of these products were, were pretty good, especially for what I was expecting. So, you know, maybe the next time you were out shopping for some affordable makeup, you might want to try checking out the dollar store. Also, Wet n Wild and LA Colors, they're pretty inexpensive. 
But you can't normally get a lot of their products for about a dollar. I mean, they're normally around there, but if you want to go try and get them for even cheaper, go to a dollar store. Okay. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, subscribe, do whatever you want. Thank you. Bye.